Hello everybody, welcome back to Angie's Diamond Painting Adventures. If you are new here, welcome and hello, my name is Angie. If you are coming back to spend some more time with me, thank you so much for coming back. Let's see what kind of adventure we're going to go on today. I think it's going to be quite dreamy, yes. We are going to go on an unboxing adventure with Dreamer Designs. Yes, this is number three from Dreamer Designs. I recently purchased a buy to get one free. My one canvas ran out of stock, so I had to go and pick another one. And this is what I picked. Yes, let's go over what's on the box and then we will get right into it. So we have some nice holographic stripes going on in there. Yes, we have how it works. Okay, so you got one, two, four, six steps on how it works. We have the kit contents. We have a Dreamer Cloud Canvas. Ooh. Pre-sorted diamond pieces. Those are the drills. Two stylus pens with multiple head options. Ooh. Two white diamond trays. Two wax caddies. A diamond straightener tool. Yes. Black diamond tweezer. Extra Ziploc bags. A reusable tool kit bag. A reusable carry bag. And an instructional guide. Yes. This is rated E for everyone and there is their website. But as you guys may know, I always put the link in my description box down below. Yes. I did just check this. This is as of May 31st. This is still in stock, guys. Yes. So let us see what comes in inside the box. Another thing that I really like about this box is, guys, it has a handle. Like, I can just carry this wherever I want, wherever I want to go. Yeah, just load everything up in the box and carry it. Love it. Love it. All right, let's get this ooh, pretty dust bag out. Yes, this is the resealable bag they were talking about, or... Not resealable, guys. Oi. Reusable bag they were talking about. I do keep all the canvases in dust bags so that it they stay protected. Yeah. Let's see what's in this reusable bag. All right. We have the canvas. Yes. Nice little purple bow going on there. We have the goodie bag, and oh my god, guys, this goodie bag is so soft. Yes, I keep making a joke, but I really do. I want a pillow out of this. This is this is like luxury, luxury, luxury. Love it. So we have the goodie bag, and of course, I hope in here, yes, we have the gorgeous drills. Yes, look at all those pretty colors, guys. This is going to be a bright one. And as you can tell by the drills, we have a square. Yeah, we're going to go over that in a minute. Let us go over the lovely goodie bag. Yes, if I can untie it, that would be awesome. There we go. <laughs> All right, let us open this nice little bag up and let's see what's inside. Yeah. All right, we have the lovely Dreamer Designs tweezers. These are absolutely wonderful. I love these tweezers. Yes, love them. We have, let's see what we got in here. Oh, here we go. We have the two white boats. These are not Mosfa boats. These are regular boats. They have the slanted edges on them, like that. 
So if you choose to use these, uh, be careful because one light touch and this will tip over. Yes. But what I really like is they are branded. Yes, a Dreamers Design branded logo on the back of the trays. Lovely. Like that. All right, what else do we have? Ah, let's get into the diamond painting pens. Yes, we do have two of them. Yep. Here is the plastic tip. This is excellent for using, uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> for using when you're doing AB diamonds. Hello, yes. Spit it out, Angie. <laughs> if you have AB diamonds in your canvas or in your kit this is excellent to use for that and then we have just the regular plain single placer but guys i'm telling you there's more there's more okay so you've got the plastic tip the regular tip you also get two purple squishies for your pen yes these just slide right onto your pen Give it a little twisty and a, okay, this one's quite tight. Okay, well, they go on the pen like that and they give you a little extra support. Let's see if this one works a little bit better. Will this one work? There we go. Just a twist and it's on there. And it just gives you a little extra support, guys. I don't know why this one does not want to, it's like stuck. There we go. There we go. There, there's that. And then here are the plastic reusable baggies. Yes, if you like to kit up in baggies, they are there for you. And I do believe that they give you enough to kit up every color. So that's awesome. Woo, everything's just falling, falling, falling. You also get two wax pots that are branded. Yes. You got a plate of round wax in there, and they are both branded. Love it. Love it. If you are new to diamond painting, before you go to use this wax, guys, there is a clear sheet on these wax circles. So make sure you pull. I'm going to take one out and just give you a short, a little example. Make sure you pull, if I can find the edge. <laughs> um, come on. Here we go. There is a clear sheet on it. So make sure you pull this clear sheet off before you start using it. All right. So there's the wax pots. You put the tweezers back in frame. And the draw trays. You also get a six placer. Yes. Fill this up with wax and you can place up to six diamonds at a time. Yes. This is one of the thick multi placers. I do not use the thick multi placers. I only use thin. But it is nice that they do provide it for you. And these just get attached to the edge end of your pen. So you can single place on this end and multi-place on that end. Beautiful. You also will get a three placer. Once again, this is one of the thick placers, so I do not use these. But same concept. You just stick it to the end of your pen like that. You've got a three placer on this side and a single placer on this side. Love it. But, guys, this is my absolute favorite tool that they provide. This is a straightener. Yes. You stick this to the edge of or the end of your pen. And then if you need to straighten any drills out, you just straighten them out. You know, put it in there, give it a little wiggle, and they will straighten out for you. So, lovely, lovely toolkit, guys. And I'm telling you, this bag is like, oh, yeah, yeah. I just want pillows in this, okay? I just, I just want a pillow made out of this fabric. It's, it's amazing. Very, very plush, as they may say. 
All right, let's get everything back into this lovely plush bag. And we will get into the canvas. Let's see what Miss Angie got this time. Yes. So with this one, I did not check to see if it was round or square. Because, guys, I do do both. Um, I just like the image. Quite simple. I, I like the image. It's nice and bright. So let me roll this back real quick. So I can flatten it out a little bit faster. This is cord glue, so you can roll this canvas backwards. Oh, I forgot what was in here. Okay. So you can roll this canvas backwards. If this was um, double-sided adhesive, you would not be able to roll this backwards um, because you would create rivers and bubbles. Um, a double-sided adhesive will come with a opaque paper. Cord glue will come with a clear cover sheet. As you will see, once I reveal this to you guys, we're going to put it like this just for a second because I want to go over what was inside there. Yes, as you can see, it comes on a foam roller. There you go. It also comes with in, an instructional sheet for you, yes. So on one side, you will have the instructions on how to diamond paint. Very nice, very, very nice. On the other side, you will find all of their social media. Yes, join the Dreamer community on Instagram and Facebook. And there you go, all the information is there. They also have a YouTube channel, guys. Yes. Go check them out. Yeah. Also inside you will find a sticker sheet. Yes. Here is the sticker sheet. We have numbers, symbols, and DMC codes. Yes. Very, very nice. And let's see towards the bottom if we have any ABs. Yes. Wow, guys. One, two, three, four ABs. Look at that. Anything that starts with an says AB, that will be an AB drill. If you are new to diamond painting and you are not sure what an AB drill is, an AB drill is a drill that has a special iridescent coating added to the top of the drill to make it shine and sparkle just a little bit more. And this kit does have AB drills, so I will point them out to you when we are going through the drills. All right, what did I get? Wowza, look at the color on that picture. Amazing, yes. Miss Angie got Race Appeal legally licensed from Carolyn Steele. Yes, this is a 50 by 40. It is absolutely gorgeous. It's bright. It's cheerful. And this is something that Miss Angie does not usually do, right? Like, how many times have you guys seen me un unbox an under the water scene? I don't think I've ever done that. So this is very new to me. This will definitely be an adventure. And yes, I will take you on the adventure with me, of course. So what is on a Dreamer Designs canvas? We have the thumbnail in the upper left with the name, the artist, the size. Okay. On the lower left, we have the beautiful legend yes in the corner here we have the uh-oh insurance yes if something happens contact dreamer designs and they will make it right for you yes we have their beautiful logo or slogan paint with passion beautiful yes 
In the lower right, we have their logo, Dreamer Designs. Lovely, lovely, lovely. And then in the upper right, we have, yes, another legend. Okay. And then across the top in the right, you have all of their social media. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. You will also find on Dreamers Design, I will pull it up nice and close for you. There is a little border here that is not diamond painted. So, and it should not be sticky either. Let's find out. So, no, the border is not sticky. So, basically, what they've done for you guys is they've already placed washi tape around this. So, yeah, it makes it a little bit easier to diamond paint. Let's check out the drill field real quick. That looks pretty clear to me. Yes. Pretty, pretty clear. Let me do it this way, guys. And there we go. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful drill field. Yes. Let's get up here in this dark area. Check this out. Yes. Very clear, guys. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. One last thing we're going to check on the canvas, and that is the sticky. Yes, the sticky is very important because if you don't have a sticky canvas, well, then it's going to be very difficult to diamond paint on it. So, we're going to lift this corner up just a little bit. We're going to take just the tip of the finger. We're going to lightly touch it. And yes, I can pick the canvas up with a light touch, which means that is very, very sticky. Yes. All right. And I love this cover sheet. Um, this is what I was telling you about. If it is poured glue, you will have a clear cover sheet. And this cover sheet is a nice cover sheet. It's not those flimsy ones. Um, it's a very sturdy cover, cover sheet. All right. We are going to flip the canvas over because we're going to go through these beautiful drills. Yes, your drill package will come labeled with the name of the picture right there. Yes, excuse the crinkling, guys, but I need to get into the bag. Yes, I need to get in the bag. Come on. <laughs> All right. Wowza. Wowza, wowza, wowza. All right. We're going to start with the first strip number and go, try to go in numerical order. Here we go. We have a beautiful 153, nice light pink. Then we have a 155, a nice purple. We have 304, that is like a red, very pretty. We have a very bright 307, yes, beautiful. We have another red in 321. We have some purples in 333. Then we have some more purples, 340. 341 is a nice dusty blue, yes. 347, we have another red, and one of my favorite yellows, 444, beautiful, yeah, alright, that was up to number 10, so let's see if I can find the strip that starts with number 11, let's see, let's see, nope, here's number 11, guys, Watch, it's going to be the last one I put my hand on. There we go. <clears throat> Number 11, we have another nice yellow, 445. Another yellow in 472. We have some 500. That is like a very deep um, hunter green. It's a very dark green. Pretty. 501 is just a little bit lighter than that one. We have a 564 beautiful mint. 
we have the infamous 666. Yes, you all know that is very bright red. We have 703. We have 704. Yeah. We have one of my favorite oranges, 740. So bright. Look at the shine and sparkle on that, guys. Amazing. 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 All right. 21. We are looking for 21. 21, anybody? 21? Um, no. Here we go. Another gorgeous orange. 741. We got a hitchhiker in there. Oh, that's okay. 747. Beautiful mint green. 772. That's very pretty. 775. One of my favorite mint greens. Yes. Then we have a 796. A nice blue. 797 is a little bit lighter blue. 799, that's, I'm sorry, 798, that's even lighter. Nice blue palette going on in there. We have a little bit of the 815s, just a little sprinkle. We have the beautiful 820. We have two bags of that, guys. Beautiful. Beautiful. All right, <clears throat> what else do we have here? We have 823, yes, nice dark navy blue. We have 895, 904, 905. Let's keep going with 906. Beautiful green palette going on there. Then we have 934, almost looks like a brown color. Very pretty. 936, that has a little bit of a green tint to it. The infamous 939s, dark navy blue. Yeah. We have 946, that is a very bright color, guys. It's almost like a electric orange. It's like really bright. And then we have 972, very, very pretty. Once again, that sparkle is insane. Yeah. All right. Number 40, we have nine. I had to look at that one real close. 987. Nice green. 989. 3328. I've never had that color. That is very pretty. It's like a corally pink or salmon. It's a salmon. Yeah. More like a salmon color. My favorite color, guys. 3607. Yes, I absolutely love this pink. Look at the shine and sparkle on that, guys. Beautiful. Then we have 3608, which is a lighter pink. 3609, which is a, a baby pink. Yes. 3712, another salmon color. 3747, a nice light blue. 3766. That is a beautiful teal. Yeah, very, very pretty. Very pretty. And then 3811, one of my other favorite mint greens that in the DMC chart. Yeah. All right. We're going to get to the ABs here in a second, guys. We have 3819. This is a very bright chartreuse color. Beautiful. Let's tip it over so you can see the shine coming off of those diamonds. Lovely. My absolute favorite purple, 3837. Yes, please. Yes, yes, yes. This is my absolute favorite purple. Here we go with the ABs, guys. Here is what I was talking about with the AB coating. This is a white, and it has just that iridescent coating on it that makes it shine and sparkle just a little bit more. We have a light yellow with a B coating. Beautiful. We have a green with a B coating. Very, very pretty. And we have a light blue with a B coating. Turn it around a little bit. Very, very pretty. 
that is gorgeous i've never had a light blue one very pretty very very pretty all right let us move these off to the side real quick let us flip race appeal over again and let's try to see if we can find where those beautiful ab's go all right so for the very first ab that was the white ab we have a circle yeah we have a circle so let's see if i can find where the circle is okay we have some in this fish here right there we have some circles going on in there let's see we have some outlining this fish right here it outlines that fish we have some in here so this is inside the fish okay Let's see what else. Do we have any down here? We have some in this fish's eye right there. That's going to be nice. Very, very pretty and outlining right there. Anywhere else? Yes, we have some right here in this fish's fin. Very, very nice. And we also have some in his eye there. Nice. Okay, the, <clears throat> excuse me, the light yellow one, okay, that's a U-turn, a U-turn, hmm, let's see, okay, so we have it up here in this little fish, the little U-turn, um, U-turn, U-turn, where are you, U-turn, now there wasn't very many in the bag so i'm not expecting to see a whole lot okay we have some in this fish here we have some u-turns right here okay outlining this fish um i think that's it guys you would think that they would put some in this nice bright yellow one down here but i'm not seeing any huh very very interesting we have a couple just a couple in the lips like two so that's interesting that they didn't sprinkle it within that fish very very interesting um then we have a little bit sprinkled in here oops bring it down angie sprinkled in here if we have any in this fish here do you guys see any don't see any it's a little u-turn oh here we go in the eye coming straight down the eye there so those are the light yellows then we had the greens that is the P, and i'm gonna assume that it's gonna be down here there they are the peas yes so it's going to highlight the greenery in this picture anywhere you see a pea that is where the green AB goes there we go we have quite a few right there I don't know if you guys can see it right here that's like a whole block we have another block going on in here so yes a very very nice I like it. I like it. And I'm pretty sure we have some going on in here. Yes, they are sprinkled in here as well. We got some there. We got some over here. So very nice. Very nice. We do not have any in this upper corner up here. There are none here. It's just where you see the bright greens. We'll put it down so the glare doesn't blind you. But right where you see the bright greens, that is where the green AB will go. And then, last but not least, we had the blue AB. That is a U. And it looks like it might go in this fish. Yes, it does. This fish right here has got the U in it. It's got it in its fin, in its mouth. Yes. We have some outlining the fish there all of these use 
these are all ABs. So it's outlining the fish. So do we have any? We have some more in this fish. Also outlining it. Very nice. Very, very nice. Let's see. We also have some in this pretty fish right here. All of those U's, the stripes, they are going to twinkle and shine, guys. Beautiful. Yes. I don't see any in this fish here. But that's okay because this fish is full of that blue AB. Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Once again, I will be leaving this link in the description box down below for you guys. It is still available as of May 31st, 2021. It is still available on the website. I am so glad that you guys came to join me on this little adventure today. If you are not currently subscribed to Angie's Diamond Painting Adventures, well, consider subscribing, guys. Yes, we have so much fun on this channel. How do you subscribe? Well, that's easy. There is a little red subscribe button right below my video. And right next to it, there will be a little bell. Once you hit the subscribe, you are automatically subscribed to my channel. And if you hit that bell, you will get notified every time that I upload a video. Now, you will not get notified every single time unless you push the bell one more time and select all. And then you will get notified each and every single time I upload a video. Yes. Also, in the description box, you will find a couple of links to help the channel out. The first link will be buy me a coffee if you choose to do so. It is not necessary. You will also find my Diamond Dots at Home distributor website link in the description box. Yes. All proceeds from both of those links come right back into the channel to bring you some more pretties. Yes, and some more lovely content and more adventures. Yes. And yes, guys, I am on Instagram. So I will leave my Instagram link in the description box as well. I think that just about covers today's adventure. We went on a dreamy adventure, adventure, woo, dreamy adventure with Dreamer Designs. Yes, and it was quite dreamy. This canvas is a very nice. Drills look gorgeous. Canvas looks gorgeous. Everything is here. Everything is complete. So this was a very dreamy adventure today. Yes. All right, guys, on that note, I will bid you all adieu, but not before I remind you to always do what you love, love what you do, and always stay adventurous. I love you guys. I will see you soon. Bye.